we're here in the Volunteer Center with Shauna Austin, Calgary Food Bank, and we're going to talk a little bit about volunteering, getting involved with the food bank, and the One Bag Challenge. So, first of all, Shauna, thank you for joining me. Um, when it comes to the food bank, volunteers are a big part of it. We could not do what we do every day if it wasn't for volunteers. We have over 130 volunteers here every day, making sure there's an impact and that we can get the food out to the families in need. Perfect. And how approximately how many people volunteer each day? We've got 131 during the day and the evening shifts, uh, thousands throughout the year. We have an incredible volunteer shift that will suit your needs, whether it's an hour a week or 5,000 a year to make that happen. So you have room to accommodate everything? Yes. Okay, excellent. And I had read that uh, a stat, 90% of your critical tasks are done by volunteers? Yes, as a nonprofit charitable organization, our focus is to make sure that if a staff member is on the job only because a volunteer couldn't fulfill that role. Perfect. And uh, one of the things that I had read and I want to share with you guys is that 37% of people who come to the food bank ever, only ever come once. One time user, that's correct? Yes, we've actually just redone our stats and it's now 41%. I've only ever had to come once. They need that emergency food hamper to get over the crisis that's in their lives. And what percentage of those people are, uh, not of that percentage, but what percentage of the people that use the food bank are children? Unfortunately, it's 42% of our food bank clients are children. Right. So again, some of the ways that people can get involved, we can have volunteer or cash donations work as well, correct? Cash is king too. For every dollar that's donated, we can leverage that into five dollars worth of food. So then we can buy the perishable food items that we need desperately in all of our hampers. Perfect. And what are some of those items, if I wanted to donate to my bag for the One Bag Challenge, what are some of those items that are top of your list? What do you always need? What do you always Number have? Number one need, peanut butter. Peanut butter. We definitely need that. We hope to see that in the One Bag Challenge, mm -hmm. as well as canned proteins, canned vegetables. Right, so your canned fishes and meats, yes. um, canned fruit. Oh, we'd love to have that. Pasta? We'll take that too. All right, because I got pasta, canned fruit, and a little bit of tuna, so I hope that helps out. Now, here's the best part of the challenge. This is kind of, if you guys remember the, the ice bucket challenge for ALS, which I also participated in, this is a challenge. I got challenged by my good friend Jared Morrison to be involved in this and donate one bag of food to the Calgary Food Bank. So, Shauna, on behalf of me. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Now, I get to challenge five people, and you have 48 hours to get this done. So, my people that I am challenging, my beautiful cousin and constant volunteer, Cindy Foley, you're on the hot seat. Jason Primer from We Wash Windows, and one of the biggest hearted men that I know, you're on the hot seat. And because I want this to have a little bit of an impact, I'm going to nominate two of Calgary's most well-known public figures. Mayor Nenshi and Brett Wilson. 48 hours. You're on the hook. You're on the hot seat. And last but not least, my good friend, certified Bronco maniac and managing editor of Calgary Metro, Darren Kraus. You're on the hot seat. 48 hours, one bag of food donated to the Calgary Food Bank. Thank you for watching, and if you're watching this and I didn't nominate you, you can still get involved by? Just go to calgaryfoodbank.com. calgaryfoodbank.com. Talk to you soon.